डायटिशियन आई एम नॉट हेयर टू मेक यू ऑनली स्लिम बट टू हेल्प यू टू मेक अ हेल्थी चॉइस आई एम अ हेल्थ गाइडर वेन इट कम्स टू फूड आई कैन हेल्प यू टू बिकम स्मार्ट कंज्यूमर वेन इट कम्स टू फूड प्रोडक्ट्स आई एम देयर विथ एवरी होम मेकर हुज ऑनली एम इज टू मेक हिज और हर फैमिली फिट एवरी डे सो टूडे वी विल टॉक अबाउट द बेसिक एंड समथिंग विच इज यूज इन एवरी डे इन एवरी किचन दैट इज ऑयल सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट there are variety of brands in market so many oils as a consumer it becomes little difficult as to which oil you should choose uh, what things you should consider while picking up your oil because it is something which is needed for every day basis and 2018 resolution that is being fit so the first thing is to choose a best oil for yourself so the first thing which should be taken into consideration is the trust towards that brand and this will be uh, inculcated once you have uh, seen such kind of things like the fssai that is food safety and standard authority of india um, label on it and everything the all details should be written either in english or hindi the details should be name or trade name the name and address of the packer and manufacturer the description of the content the volume it should have the batch number the year of manufacturing and the registration number the second thing which you should take into consideration is reading the label that's really very very important when it comes to any of your food products specifically here you have to see the edible oil or the oil which you are choosing which uh, ingredient it has like does it has mustard oil or is it a groundnut oil or a olive oil the main ingredient the second thing which you all should always see that it doesn't have any of these expression like super refined double refined extra refined uh, cholesterol free soothing to the heart anti cholesterol don't go on these things because these are such expression which are only to exaggerate for the advertisement purpose they are not at all useful the third thing which you should always look that is saturated fatty acids mono uh, unsaturated fatty acids and poly unsaturated fatty acids these three things please keep it in mind the uh, sfa should be very very less whereas the pufa should be very high in any of a good oil which is very healthy now the question comes the quantity how much oil you should buy for your family this is a very simple mathematic that is half liter for per family member it's so simple to decide if you have four family members in a house half liter that is 2 liters you will be needing in total okay so this includes half a liter of oil for per family member per month now the last question comes is the affordability affordability i will club it with purpose because they go hand in hand because end of the day we have to be a smart consumer and have to choose the best so um you should choose oil according to their purpose like for frying you should use oil such as groundnut oil rice bran oil sunflower oil they have high smoke point even when you heat them for a longer period of time they will not uh, lose the nutrients they have and go for a refined oil when it comes to frying then comes for salad and dressing or dips such uh, for these kind of purposes you should use oil like olive oil flaxseed oil walnut oil or coconut oil i know they are little expensive so they should be only used for salad and dips coconut oil please keep it in mind that it is healthy but use it very less because it has saturated fatty acids 
and the last thing comes for sauteing and stir frying for that you can use soya bean oil or mustard oil mustard oil can be all purpose oil too and soya bean oil is new to indian market which is really very good rice bran oil is new in india japan and korea and it is gaining popularity also it is very good in antioxidant and is the best oil used for deep frying i hope you like this video do subscribe to our channel hit the button like and stay tuned for more and more videos thank you so much for watching bye